Our plan kind of worked, sort of. I mean, we were gonna take a nap and we actually napped for like four hours or so, so it was more like sleep than nap, but whatever. Hello everyone and welcome to Monday. It's Monday now. Um, since I've been up, I recorded a bunch of Assassin's Creed. Gotta have it done for this weekend. I'm not gonna have a chance to record more on that later. For now, we're gonna go over to my parents' house and uh, we're actually gonna be making shrimp curry because we have curry all the time, but my mom doesn't eat chicken, but she'll eat shrimp. So we're gonna have shrimp curry. Are you excited? Yes. Because I'm super pumped because we've never had this with shrimp. Yes. You're just anxious to go. Yes. Confirm. All loans have been paid in full. Thank you and have a nice day. Woo! I just paid off the $198,000 one. I just wanted to keep you guys updated of, of kind of how much I've been playing and where I am in the game. I haven't been, I haven't done any kind of like ordinances or what are the other ones, the projects. No, I did start the bridge project, but I haven't paid any money on it because I want to just upgrade my house. But, but there you go. Oh, and while I'm here, I should probably show you how dinner is going. Salads. Uh, it looks pretty amazing. It's fantastic. We've never actually made this much before because we're making it for four people. We've also never used shrimp, so that's going to be different. Um, they are doing some brown rice and we're doing jasmine rice, so we'll have different types of rice. But it smells fantastic. It smells just as good as it looks. And also, there's going to be dessert of cupcakes and they look fantastic. Nothing else, it sure is pretty. Yeah, it is very pretty. Plating looks really nice. Normally, whenever Mao makes it, I have mine in a bowl, but it looks so much prettier on a plate. You kinda got a puddle going. Yeah. It was delicious. It was the best I could do. Good job, Mao. And you. Mom. Yeah, it was very Both good. Both of you. The women's. How did you like it, though, since this was your first it was time very you- very good. Very, very, very different for us, but we Yeah, really you guys it. don't need a lot of um, Asian cuisine. But it is good. Mm -hmm. it is, it's nice with the shrimp, too. I think I prefer chicken, but it's still really good. Another interesting thing uh, today is that um, my grandfather's sister, my, my mom's aunt, Your my great aunt, going around the, the circle there, um, sent my mom uh, these sheets of paper, which are of interest to me because it's actually some of our genealogy. Um, it goes back to the late 1800s. Uh, we have Moses and Sarah, and it has their, uh, their dates, uh, right there, how long they lived. And we just have this, um, this really interesting sheet that actually goes through, um, some of the people, all the way till we get down here. James Miller, that was my grandfather. So... I don't know. It's just really cool uh, because I don't know anything about our genealogy, so this is kind of, you know, really, really interesting to me. That's the dad's side. This was uh, grandma's side. Okay, that's, all right, that's... Your grandma's, great-grandma's gran side. Yeah, maternal side, and this is paternal side. There's just so much information. I mean, it's cool. I'm glad that this is saved because I've never seen anything like this. Also, um, my mom has been going through more of the, uh, the, I guess, photo books and things that she's never even seen before that we have. Um, and she found this card that my grandmother gave to my grandfather, and it's just really ornate. Probably when they were dating. It just looks very well done. Cards aren't made like this anymore. I don't even know if they have, if they had envelopes for this, because this is so huge. Also, among the, uh, the many, many things, there are tickets, speeding tickets, uh, traffic violations um, in the back here for my grandfather, because my grandfather was a uh, speed demon, and it's been really interesting to see some of this stuff. Um, for example, in this one, um, it says that he was going, I know it's going to be hard for you guys to see, but it says he was actually going 56 in a 30. And he got a uh, speeding ticket for $11.45. And this was in uh, July, July 5th, 57. So that'll be ah, many, many years. Um, 1957. Um, so that'll be 1957. 
what, uh, Friday, Friday's July 5th. Uh, and then over on this one, um, he was stopped at uh, 4.15 a.m. because he was operating on an expired 15-day tag, and he got charged uh, 6.45. It's just really interesting. I mean, these are, they've survived the test of time in the back of this book. And my grandfather was notorious for driving fast, and he didn't care, and he always had speeding tickets. Like 56 and a 30, which seems very, very unsafe. And that was before he was married. Yeah, <laughs> it didn't get any better. This book is really fallen apart. The, uh, the bottom binding is not even connected anymore, but it's still holding up. Um, this picture, I don't know if we've ever shown them before. I've only ever seen a very, very few, a handful of images at best. Um, these are my mom's grandparents uh, on my on her dad's side. So my great paternal no great maternal grandparents. Paternal. Well, great paternal maternal. Okay. Your your dad's parents <laughs> yes. is what I'm trying to my say. I don't even know how to properly Noah. say that. Grand grandma and grandpa Noah. Um, they were both very tall people, um, and they sure. both smoked. Um, apparently, they were both really big smokers. Um, this is my uh, great aunt. That's my great aunt. That's Sally. Sally, and she's still alive. She's with a cat in the snow in that picture. There's a lot of interesting things here. I'm almost positive this is a uh, a picture of my my uh, paternal grandfather. I mean, he's got to be really really young in that one, and I believe he's there, um, right there in center frame th uh, as well. This was probably his dog too. <laughs> Yeah, there's some things I, mean, I guess we just don't know, just... and never will. But uh, there's a lot. I mean, I know that we've a we've actually shown a lot of pictures and stuff on the vlog before. If this is interesting to you, um, look up the vlog called Panto Teeter. And if if someone wants to put a, a day number in the uh, comments below, in case I forget to put it in the description, do that. Um, it's a fascinating look at some old pictures of both sure, my uh, my grandparents. Is this right after they were married? No, I think that's probably, um, that looks like a prom. Or like a prom picture? Mm -hmm. There, it's in focus. Yeah, that would have been, um, it says spring F. Is that like a spring fling type thing, or maybe that's some kind of prom thing? That's what, um, that's the way he's dressed with a bow tie, and the way mom's Well, the other pictures that are around this time, um... So th this was like around... Um, it says it's in 55. Yeah, and that's probably when they are. So mom your was mom 15. was your mom was 15 my dad was and would have been 20. Mm -hmm. So that would have been my uh, my grandfather at 20 years old, and my grandmother at 15. And uh, he was a tall guy. Here's one where they're about the same age, probably about 15 and uh, 20. <laughs> There's a lot of pictures of her just. I'm assuming she took these for him while he was in the, uh, military. the military. Did you ever state that he was stationed in Fort Jackson, where you guys close to where you guys were living? No, I don't think I ever said that. Um, my my grandfather was at Fort Jackson, which is about a mile away from where we lived when we were in Columbia last year. Um, and we never went over there, and I'm sure it looks way different than it does in some of the pictures in this book. But it's still kind of nifty, because I knew that he had had been there. And he was there for several years. He was also in Germany uh, for a time. At the same time, Elvis Presley was there. Really? Uh-huh. <laughs> at first glance, that picture almost like, looks like it could be me. Mm -hmm. That's something I would wear, too. There he is again with someone else. You can see actually a picture of Darlene behind him oh, in, yes, in that can. picture. That's oh. really cool. Um, another thing, actually she's labeled in that picture, uh, right here. Actually what's interesting is that, uh, and my mom pointed this out, he's referred to as Ish in, hi in, the, uh, in pictures, tons of pictures, always Ish. Um, like down here, you know, Matt, Winters, and Ish. So there he is. I don't, I don't know where that name came from. You don't know anything never about that. Don't ever recall him. And he that. never mentioned that. Yeah, I Ish. Don't. I'm going to ask his sister. That's really, really interesting. Yeah, there it is again. You know, I kind of wonder if it would be, I mean, it'd probably be impossibly difficult to try and contact 
some of these people, but you know, some of the the guys that he were he was in the military with, their names are in here. Mm -hmm. you now I wonder how hard it would be to try and contact them so you could, you know, learn interesting things. Mackinish. Yeah. His underwear. <laughs> yeah. He, in a lot of these he has a guitar. White undershirt. White undershirt. <laughs> yeah, that's where I get that from, right? There it is. In here. Guitar. Guitar. Ish. Ish. It's all they're all ish. This says hillbillyism. <laughs> This is Oscar. That's my um, grandfather's uncle. No, you know, yeah. Yeah. Uncle, so that'd be my great great uncle, I believe. Yeah, that's double greats. That's Oscar. Um, he's on the end, two pictures. He's in this picture, and then this picture is labeled me, dad, and Oscar. So it's my grandfather, his father, and then his father's. Uh, brother. And then here's another picture of uh, my grandfather's dad. So my my great-grandfather. And these pictures are actually pretty big. It says army type. Playing gu guitar. And another one with the guitar. And Darlene in the background again. There's The walls are completely white. It's just that one picture up there. And in his wallet that I have, mm -hmm. that picture is in, was in his wallet. Really? He carried that his whole life. Hmm. And that's uh, that was one from when she was like 15 or something. Yeah. So it was a long time when ago. Started dating. Anyway, there's tons and tons of pictures in this book, but I mean, I never saw pictures of anything related to this. I haven't seen a whole lot of pictures of um, any of my grandparents when they were younger, and this is stuff that. You know, on that old vlog, Panto Teeter. I mean, that was like one of the first times I'd ever seen any of this stuff. And you just, you just got, you just found this book like the other day. Yeah. So. I stuff on it. Just have never went through because I got, you know, boxes of it. So this is actually. I mean, you just saw this stuff for the first yeah. time recently. Yeah. There's pictures of my mom and, um, you know, when she was 15, and yeah, I had never seen none of this. I just wish this was stuff that they'd have pulled out whenever I was yeah. home. And, so they could explain down? some of the yeah. stuff. It's really cool. It's really cool. And I like I like seeing this stuff. One of the long term goals I have is to, you know, scan things, you know, and preserve them digitally. It's just it's kind of an overwhelming thing because there's so much to do, but it's something I want to get around to eventually. Anyway, um for continuity's sake, I'm gonna call this Panto Teacher Two. Just because I decided to. Um, that's going to be it for today. Lots, lots of more work to do, but this was a nice little break. We had to come over here for dinner anyway, so I'm glad you guys got to see some of this stuff. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? They were bad, they were bad, they were bad, but they were just curious. They were like playing the sheet I have laid down. Yeah, but now things are good. Hey. When are you going to... Uh, that hasn't happened so far in the LP before. I mean, I'm going to be completely changing... Piss. Ah!